Hello my friends and welcome back to my channel. With the last update on the LG G2 and the C2 update number 03 2024, LG introduced a new feature called Dolby Vision Precision Detail. And this feature is just available when you use Dolby Vision content and then just in certain picture modes, standard, vivid and cinema home. Please keep in mind, I was not able to activate this feature in the gaming Dolby Vision gaming mode. Um, regardless of what I tried with my Xbox, it is just grayed out and I can't turn it on. So let's talk about this Dolby Vision Precision Detail feature today. And yeah, I made a little bit of a comparison. So let's see what I found out. But if you now think you will have a very big difference when you turn on this new feature, then um, spoiler alert, no, it's not the case. It is actually very subtle, very minor. And I had to look very, very closely to see actually a difference. Okay, so before I show you now my comparison, let me explain to you what you can expect. And it is really not much because it's very hard to show you the difference on still pictures because I can't show you moving pictures from Netflix and uh, the footage what I took from Netflix was called uh, Our Planet, which is great picture quality. So this is what you can see from Our Planet and still pictures. It looks like I uploaded this part already to YouTube to make sure there's no copyright um, yeah, issue or whatever. But as soon I would upload moving picture from Netflix to YouTube, it's a complete different story. So I can't show you this, but this is a problem because what I found is with my side by side comparison, it's very hard to see a difference. Even when I'm looking on my, my footage here, not on YouTube uploaded, you know, you know what I mean? I, it's the best quality what I can do and I can't barely see a difference. I, there is a very, very minor difference in terms of brightness, in terms of contrast, because this is what this option is doing. It, it, it's increasing the brightness very, very minor and it gives you a little bit more contrast between darker and brighter objects. So it looks like you will see more textures, more um, details on darker objects. And it looks like it also removes a little bit of a gray shade on the picture. So ac actually something what dynamic contrast is doing when you turn it on and off. It, really looks like this. Um, very, very subtle, very, very minor. But again, this is the only way what I can show you. I mean, I show you this in a second in full screen, of course. Give it a try. Please keep in mind, it's just available in uh, the Cinema Home standard and vivid mode. But out of those three, actually, I just can recommend Cinema Home. It is not working in Dolby Vision Gaming, unfortunately. Maybe that's an issue with um, input lag or something like that. I was not able to get it running in this mode but yeah there's actually really not much what we're missing out let's have a look on my comparison and then let's talk of let's do a summary
Okay, so what is the summary? What is my conclusion? Um, it's a nice to have feature, but that's it. You're not missing anything on the CX or C1 or G1. That's what I can tell you because the difference what I have seen so far and of course I have to say this, I just tested our planet on Netflix. Nothing else so far. Maybe I'm looking at the wrong content, but with this content, the difference between on and off was very, very minor and you would not see it if you're not looking very closely. Okay. Side by side comparison, as you have seen, is very hard to spot something. I just like to repeat myself. It looks like uh, the picture is slightly brighter with uh, the option turned on and also the contrast is slightly better. It means uh, you have more, uh, yeah, between darker objects and brighter objects, uh, it is better visible. How should I, I don't know how to, how should I say it's it looks like the contrast is better okay that's how it is okay like a dynamic contrast option but of course it's not called like this not 100% sure what this uh, function is really really doing because I looked so closely even on very small details I couldn't find yeah very hard very hard I mean leave it on leave it on because it doesn't make the picture worse in my opinion not at all it makes it a little slightly very minor subtle better okay but that's it okay there's nothing um, where you should be sad about it if you don't have a g2 or a c2 because it's really not that much of an improvement okay so that's my take on this new feature which i appreciate actually that we have something like that but again not a day and night difference in my opinion put in the comment section what you think about this new feature and what you think about the new update in general and by the way i'm not uploading a new video about this update because uh, one copyright issue is enough. Uh, anyway, I'm not doing this anymore. I need to be very careful what I have run in the background in the future. Anyway, that's it for this video. I say thank you very much. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.